And it's neat because that builds into the first of our finale explosions, where we do a similar thing, but replace the Erlenmeyer flask with a soda bottle. Now, if we screw the cap onto that, the pressure is going to build up and you're not just going to pop the cap off. The bottle's going to rupture and that'll explode. And it's a nice big sound. There is the potential of flying plastic. So what we do is we keep that inside uh, what's essentially an industrial garbage bin. You know, it's a little bit thicker plastic than maybe your kitchen bin, but not much. And we put the bottle with the liquid nitrogen in the bin and cover it. Now, that's not an airtight seal, but it's sealed enough so that when the bottle uh, does eventually pop, none of the plastic goes flying anywhere. Mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. But you get a big bang and maybe the lid of the garbage can goes flying. Make sure the students are back, say, 15 feet so they don't get hit by that. 